Well, hello, my friend, and welcome to my channel. Today, I've got my little haul I did with Polish Pickup last month. Um, even though I missed out <clears throat> on making videos for a while, I was still buying polish and stuff. So, let's get started. I got the Lillian's Garden Hand Cream, and look how pretty that is. And this one's called Rainbow Galaxy, and it smells delicious, and it's really nice on the skin. I love this. I love everything I've tried from Lillian's Garden. Now, of course, none of these products are available right now, but this will just give you an idea of the kind of things you can find on Polish Pickup. I also got this Fast and Hard Quick Dry Glossy Top Coat, and this one is from www.vibrantvinyls.com and it's called Galactic Unicorn uh, and it, it smells really good too for, for a top coat. I have used this. It's actually on both of these manicures right here and it is really nice. It's really nice and thick and it does dry rock hard super fast. So the next one I got was was it Sorry? Sari, Sari. <laughs> I had to get this one because it's there we go. Moonbeam Dreams, and it's beautiful. It's like a mauvey, purpley color with lots and lots of uh, flaky stuff going on in there. The next one I have is from Pretty Jelly, and this one's called um, I Am Groot, and it is like a foily type polish with lots of flakies in there too and I will swatch these real quick if I can quit talking and get to it and this is quick talks polish or I, I don't know you guys know I have trouble with uh, pronouncing things but I had to get this one because it's called to the moon and back <laughs> me and my friend um, Jan were just talking about to the moon and back and I had to have this this is a beautiful purple with lots of like blue and green flakies. I think it's going to have some shift going on there. Can you see down here where it's kind of picking up another color? <laughs> Excited! And then I've gotten this Native War Paints um, called Nothing's Gonna Change My World. And that's a Beatles reference. So I had to have that and it is a beautiful, beautiful polish. So let me get my bottles open and we're gonna swatch these. Okay, I am using my reusable nail wheel. I did go investigate these and what I'm seeing on their website, it says like uh, white or neutral. Well, this is neither one of those. This is clear. This is the one that they called clear. And it says clear on the description, but when it gives you the options to buy one, it's or a two pack. It's um, you, you either select neutral or um, or white. So I, I don't know if they're ever going to get these clear ones in again. I will be eyeballing it though. So let's get started here with Moonbeam Dreams. And this is gorgeous. I have already worn this one. And it was during my time when things were really crazy around here. I never did any nail art on it or wore it, you know, or did anything on my channel with it. So we will have to revisit that one again so you can see it. The next one is I Am Groot. And I've just been really into these, like, foily, flaky looking polishes. I don't know what's up with that. And the next one we have is To the Moon and Back. Oh wow, I wasn't expecting that to look black. I was expecting it to look purple. I bet it looks a lot more purple when it builds up. So here we go with the first coat of that one. And then Nothing's Going to Change My World. And I do have something kind of similar to this. I will have to dig through my stuff once I get it all organized and see if we can do a comparison. Maybe I can find you guys something out there that is very similar since these are no longer available. Um, here we go with our second coat of the first one. Moonbeam Dreams. And this one's just gorgeous. Two coats is full coverage on that. Love it. <clears throat> Next, we have our second coat of I Am Groot. 
And I would have loved to have done these on my natural nails, these swatches, but I just, I've got so much to do and so much to share that today we're just going to make a dent in some of the sharing and do it this way. That is just gorgeous. Look at how pretty. Love it. I think that one's going to need another coat. And then we're going to move on to to the moon and back. It's building up pretty nice too. And you guys know how I feel about these polishes that are kind of on the edge of needing another coat. I would layer this one over black just to save the special polish. And it does have some color shifting things going on in there. It's gorgeous. So I'll do another coat of that. And then nothing's going to change my world. Second coat of that one. This is that nail with a little chip out of it. <laughs> Oh, that is just so pretty. I hope the camera picks up all the colors of that. Okay, so I'm going to let these dry for a few um, so that I can do a second coat of these two. So I will be right back. All right, I am back. These are a little drier, and we're going to do a third coat of I Am Groot. And this one's just so blanktastic. Love that. third coat of I Am Group, and then we're going to do a third coat of To The Moon and Back. It does get a lot more purple looking after you build it up. It looks like maybe it's a black jelly-like with lots of purple shimmer going on in it, and it's got those insane flakies. So there we go. We have Moonbeam Dreams, I Am Groot, To the Moon and Back, and Nothing's Gonna Change My World. So there are the swatches for the four polishes I picked up at the last polish pickup. I will leave a link down below for polish pickup. You can go check them out. I love that their shipping is only $3 in the U.S. and it's it doesn't matter how many you buy. And I love that they've got other products to try, like these top coats and the hand creams. So, that is it for today. I hope you enjoyed this one. Leave me a comment down below. Let me know which one of these was your favorite, and if you got any of these from the Polish Pickup. So, until next time, be good to yourself. I'll talk to you soon. Bye.